Are you sick and tired of gambling your hard earned money on Madden packs? Look no further than my sponsor, MMO EXP, for the cheapest and most reliable muck coins on the market. And don't forget to use code FURDY at checkout for 5% off. What's going on, guys? Today we are looking at the brand new Blitz. Anthony Richardson has a chance to be the best quarterback in the game. And I know I'm a little bit late with this gameplay, but I have to try this card out. I have to get this video out for you guys. 91 speed, 90 acceleration with the Gunslinger Strat card, 95 throw power. And the accuracy stats look pretty good across the board. 91 short, 90 mid, 89 deep accuracy. 88 throw under pressure should be okay. And from what I've been hearing, his release is okay. We're obviously going to go into practice mode. I don't have Gunslinger on the card today. Um, but I want to see how this release is going to feel. And then as a ball carrier, I thought he may, would actually probably be a little bit better as far as trucking and things like that go. Um, has a good enough break tackle. I thought he'd be more like Cam Newton as a runner. Um, but even low carrying, I probably wouldn't use this card too much and just let him take hits like that. Very dissimilar to, to real life. You saw what happened when he took too many hits in real life. Um, for the abilities, yes, he does get set feet. Um, same ability setup as Mahomes besides not getting hot route master. Mahomes does get hot route master. Richardson does not get hot route master. Um, and then you have obviously gunslinger, all that other stuff there. So, I mean, yeah, yeah let's go into practice mode. Um, test out this release. Then we're going to hop into some gameplay. Okay, we're in practice mode. Let's see the release. He has the slinger three release. I do like slinger releases normally because they have a pretty nice flick. But obviously not using Gunslinger, being used to using Gunslinger this whole year. It has been a slight adjustment for me, at least. I know I like having set feet, you know, because I'm able to kind of get the ball into small windows. But uh, yeah, that slow release should be a little bit tough. I do think it's probably better than Mahomes. Though. I will say it's better than Mahomes card. Um, so if you, if you have been using Mahomes, this card will probably be a pretty big upgrade for you. Let's see that throw on the run real quick. Obviously, Mahomes is kind of king at throwing the run, but even that release is, uh, is pretty good. So this card should move pretty well, should play pretty well. Um, and this is actually probably like the perfect quarterback <laughs> For my play style, I like moving a little bit my quarterback. Also, you know, 91 speeds, very top tier at that position right now. Let's see that release one more time. It's not bad. I mean, I obviously got to get down the timing a little bit, but it's not as bad as I thought it was going to be. People really over, like, really, you know, talking too down on his release. It's not that bad. It really isn't. Let's see one more time over the middle to Odell. It's not bad. It gets there quick. It, it, it does get there quick. Before we get into the gameplay, if you are in the 50% of people who watch the videos and are not subscribed, let's head down there, change that right now. Hit that subscribe button, turn on those notifications. Shout out for today's video goes to my man Carter for commenting the emoji on last video. And if you want a chance to be shout out in the next one, let's comment the smiley face emoji. All right, here we go. Into game number one, we are playing, of course, the new college OT house rules. Whenever this game mode is in the game, you know, I got to I gotta play it. 100%, I got to use it. Got to play it. It's, um, it's great for gameplays, but also I think it's just so much fun, you know, getting in and out of games as fast as possible. But here we go. Uh, and then Richardson. And by the way, if you are curious as to who else has the Slinger 3 release, it's the same as Josh Allen and the same as Troy Aikman. So it is fast in some instances. Other instances, though, there's going to be problems. I, I won't lie. I, I mean, short, like, short left is really bad on this card um you're gonna feel that you might not see it in today's gameplay but someone that's used josh allen someone that's used troy aikman um i will tell you right now that that will be a problem for you at some point you're gonna feel it and be like what what was that even with gunslinger even without it doesn't matter quick quick throw to the flat and we get a nice gain of one we wish we got a little bit more than that but it is what it is all right here we go i'm gonna try to throw this ball to randy moss over the middle that is the plan i also want to put garrett wilson on a little in on the back side there see what he's gonna play and we should get, I think I had, yeah, I probably did have Randy Moss. It would have been a tough throw, but with set feet, that's definitely one you can make. And it feels like this guy's just running stock cover three. So we're going to come out here. We're going to run um, corner out dig, uh, fade the outside receiver. And then we're going to put uh, Everett on the flat. And we should get Odell Beckham for a touchdown. Hopefully we can get it there. He does back everybody up. It might be a tough throw because of where the zone drops are get it there richardson and that is a throw that makes like set feet lead makes that throw possible without it it does get a little bit more dicey than that but obviously we're gonna go for two here we're gonna go with um let's go read option we got Andy richardson we probably gotta we gotta at least try one read option of course so let's come out here read option this is probably one of the better read options in the game because you get a lead blocker as well um even and even if you're gonna keep with the running back it's obviously still very good too so um the read's gonna be how we long this guy's had a pretty good team by the way and he doesn't yeah that's gonna be a touchdown oh maybe not oh boy you see that speed? Oh, turn the corner. Yeah, that, that's, that's the speed of Anthony Richardson right there, man. That is the speed. That's way too easy. Okay, we're now on defense. And while we're on defense, let's talk about the Blitz promo. I did a video yesterday talking about all, like, great, basically grading all the cards. But obviously, the full stats came out. And, you know, we have a bunch of, like, basically every single card is top tier at their position. But uh, some cards that I think are kind of underrated are the offensive linemen. I mean, that is Steve Avila and Joe Titman. Both cards have 87 speed. If you've been watching the videos... 
uh, for a while. You know, I've been someone that that's always kind of basically overhyped speed on linemen, but I'm telling you, Joe Tittman, Steve Avila, they're going to be crazy. Uh, no matter what team you put them on, because normally, you know, we're talking about 80. What, how that even happen? What's that going? We're usually we're talking about like 80, maybe 75 speed for offensive linemen, and that's considered really fast. But now we have 87 speed offensive linemen. I mean, it's going to play crazy. I'm telling you right now, it's going to play crazy. I do have Joe Tittman. Steve Avila is obviously not in the game yet while I'm recording this. But, you know, <laughs> someone having a... Uh, Someone having a Jets uh, Rams team, it actually kind of works out perfectly. You know what I mean? Like perfect because I, I, you know, both guys get plus one speed on my team. But yeah, I guess I am kind of surprised by the price of the LTD specifically. Like, you know, Puka Nakua, that should be a pick. It's not going to be a pick. But Puka Nakua going for 2 million and then Nolan Smith going for 2.5 is, is crazy. Like, none of those cards are worth it. I don't think, even for a million, a lot of these cards I would probably say hold off on and I, I would wait on. Um, I wouldn't buy a card for a million coins. I, like right now, early in Blitz, I'm buying some of the more budget cards. Like like I said, Joe Timmon and guys like that. And this guy's throwing a nice comeback there out of bounds. Also, that, that C route keeps getting underneath. I'm actually going to call zone coverage here and just try getting this stop. I'm not sure why this guy didn't just score the touchdown, though. I don't know why he just didn't. He had it easy. I don't know what he was thinking. All right, here we go. Shade him down. He might go streak on the outside there, but if he does, it's okay. Yeah, I, I, don't, I don't even need a flat. I don't even know why I'm playing a flat. So in the middle, stop him short. Okay, I'm getting a KO. And we do uh, walk out of here with a win. Okay, let's get into another game. All right, here we go. We got game number two. Uh, this could maybe be the last game, depending on how we do with Anthony Richardson. Um, but like I said, so far, so good with this card. Obviously, the speed, the release. I mean, this is pretty common um, at this point. The flat's going to be over. We're going to go ahead and get it there. And see, that release is the one that I, I'm not a fan of. And even with Gunslinger, it doesn't actually really fix it. Um, you're still going to kind of have that slow release. I'm actually going to try to... Let, let's flip this. He's running cover six, so it should auto flip. It should auto flip. Hope it does. And if it does, I'll show you that short left release. But even with Gunslinger, this release is not perfect. So if you are going to use Anthony Richardson or even Josh Allen or even or even uh, Troy Aikman for that matter, I would just use Sefeet or whatever else you'd use because it's not like it really fixes everything we should have that over the middle and that that's the good release right there that's the good one the you know the short ones in the outsides are not the good ones and that's the problem because normally when you're throwing to that part of the field it's because you're getting blitz so you want to get the ball out quick that's normally what you're trying to do but you know that release right there that quick flick over the middle that's what we're looking for right there that's exactly what we're looking for and also i just realized that there's ways you can get like alternate points in this house rules i didn't even know that was even a thing but let's let's just keep this with i'm gonna keep this ball with richardson no matter what here hopefully we can find the end zone he should be oh he's not ready for that at all another easy very easy two-point conversion um yeah i mean ha comparing his speed to a guy like mahomes and i've actually gone away from using mike vick recently um and i've been using uh I, I used kurt warner for like a week and then i used patty um and now i have richardson but you know the, you know, the speed on this card just feels so much better if <laughs> like it's night and day really and hopefully we do start getting some more fast uh, you know set feet lead quarterbacks but I mean, after we get our fast set feet lead quarterbacks, what's next for the quarterback position? Like, how does it continue to progress after this? I don't know. We still have a lot of the year left. And maybe it's maybe it's hot round map. Oh, that's gonna be a dunk on. No, it's not. Okay, there we go. But um, maybe it'll be hot round master, set feet. I don't know how the how this year is gonna progress, but even that setup with this current AP, it's not coming season three because we don't have enough AP on offense to even really do that. Um, so I don't know what they're gonna do. Very interesting. I don't know. I'm just gonna keep I'm just gonna keep swatting the ball. That's not gonna work. Yeah, let's shit over the top. Just look out for the over the top ball. Over the middle, that's good. Okay, just <laughs> do it through four stri three straight picks, and we just swat every single one. That's crazy. I'm going to shit over the top again. Fourth and four fourth and 15. Using Barry. That's probably free Mike Vick as well. Has it over the middle, and can we please pick a ball off? It's okay. I mean, we win, but just pick one of these off, please. Okay, for Anthony Richardson's final report, I'm going to give him 19 stars. The one knock on this card is the release just not being perfect. Physically, 6'4", 244, crazy speed, good acceleration. Um, Stat-wise, as far as a passer, he's very good. I do wish the carrying was a little bit higher, but I'm not going to knock him down a star grade because of that. So, still five stars for the stats and the physical um, abilities. He does get set feet. He doesn't get hot round master, which could be enough. But for me, that's not that big of a deal. At least he does get one of the two. So, yeah, I'll give, him f I'll give him five stars for abilities and animations. Um, like I was saying throughout this whole video, the release is somewhat inconsistent. Even with Gunslinger, it's not going to get fixed. But, you know, some throws you're going to make and you'll be like, what release is that? Like, I've never seen that release before. That ball came out fast. And other times it's going to be like, all right, what just happened? Why did that football not come out of his hand? So, Anthony Richardson, we're going to give him 19 stars. As far as do I think he's the best quarterback in the game right now? Yeah, I, I do think he is. You know, the combination of speed and set feet lead is overpowered and... 
you know, a bunch more of these rollout offenses kind of getting popular now in Madden 24. Richardson's going to be a threat, man. The card's going to be a threat for sure. Um, definitely better than Patty. Um, I think better release than Patty. And then also, you know, him having 11 better speed than Patty and a, being a better ball carrier definitely does put him over Patrick Mahomes to me. And to me, Mahomes was my favorite before this. Now I'm going to give that crown to Anthony Richardson. As far as when I would buy the card, I probably would wait for him to get down to, if he's able to get down to like seven, eight, that's where I would buy this card. I wouldn't buy him at 1.1. And as this promo kind of goes on, his price will drop definitely towards the end when they drop a bunch of you know, special offers and things like that that are more enticing than what, than what we've seen so far. So, Anthony Richardson, 19 stars. I'll see you boys in the next one.